I think one of the really important transformations that occurred in human evolution occurred around two million years ago when the origins of the genus Homo occurred. And one of the things that happened at that time is that we started to increase brain size. This is the graph of time before the present, and this is the size of the brain. And you can see there was a big shift that started around two million years ago. People's brains started getting bigger. Now, brains are wonderful things, but most animals don't have big brains because there are costs associated with brains. Brains are very expensive. Uh, those of you sitting here listening to me are using about 20% of your brain, 20% uh, of your body's basic energetic rate, you know, what's called the resting metabolic rate, just paying for your brain right now. And if you're not listening to me, you're still spending about 20% of your metabolic rate <laughs> just paying for your brain. When you're asleep, you spend about 20% of your body's met uh, met metabolism just paying for your brain. Brains are thirstily tissues that relentlessly need energy, and they need it even when you're not thinking. And you, but your brains don't store energy. Brains rely on energy supplies that come from the rest of the body. So brains are very costly. So in order to have bigger brains, we needed to have, um, we needed to have more energy. We also shifted our life history, as I mentioned before. As I, as I, uh, you know, uh, our ancestors had offspring every six years, but we figured out how to double the rate at which we reproduce and have offspring every three years. That's a, that's a big energetic shift. You need to have twice as much energy in order to do that. We also spend much more time growing our offspring. Here's, here's Prince William when he was 12 years old. I think that's Prince William, right? And um, at that age, if he were a chimpanzee, he'd be a full-grown, reproducing male chimpanzee. But as a 12-year-old as a teenager, he's still got a long time to go before he can ever have children, right? So we've actually increased the amount of time it takes to grow our offspring before they can start having um, children. And that's more energy. It takes more energy to grow a human up to be a reproductive uh, adult. That's, that's, that's energy. It's all about energy. 